One person is dead after this deadly crash in Prince George's County. Sky Fox was over the scene, and this is a stretch of road where there was another deadly crash just last week. Lindsay Watts standing by live tonight in Seat Pleasant. She is the latest tonight. Lindsay? Jim, the intersection here reopened within the past hour tonight. You can still see all of the glass in the roadway. This is the intersection of Central Avenue and Garrett Morgan Boulevard. I spoke to a woman who was driving here with her son right around 4 o'clock when this three-car crash happened. She said her son got out of the car to try to help the victims, and she recorded the moments that followed. Oh my gosh, we just saw this accident happen right here on Central, and my son and them is out there trying to save this person. Please, Lord, let them be okay. Police say the man in this red car that overturned did not survive. The woman who recorded that video, her name is Linda. She says everything happened so quickly. She didn't see exactly what occurred. She says tonight she wants to give condolences to the family of that man who died. Police say the other two drivers involved were okay and did not need to go to the hospital. Seat Pleasant Police also tell me prior to this crash, there was another crash about a block away also on Central Avenue, a hit and run that left a man injured. They say tonight they're investigating whether the car that sped away from that crash was also involved in this one. They say so far no arrests have been made or citations issued. This man also heard the crash and saw the aftermath. I just heard the sound. When I heard the sound, I have to come out. So when we come outside, we saw the man in the car. He's still in the car there before the police officer, the emergency rescue came. So they tried to just take him out of the car. His business is on this road, and he says it's dangerous. A little over one week ago, there was another deadly wreck here on Central Avenue. Police say a man died and a woman was critically hurt. People tonight have compared Central Ave to a racetrack. Police on scene tell me they encounter people driving 40 to 50 miles over the 35 mile per hour speed limit. They say speeding is typically the cause of the crashes they're seeing here in Seat Pleasant. Earlier today, police were putting in speed cameras just a few miles away on Central Avenue. But some people are saying that they want to see more speed cameras in this area, as well as additional police enforcement. Tonight, police say they continue to investigate what led up to this crash, and they are hoping to talk to witnesses who saw what happened. If you have any information, contact Seat Pleasant Police. Back to you.